Moon movie, well, it's about 20, 25 minutes of it. It's like hyper surreal. It's taking place in some countryside of some unknown country, and there's a war going on, but it's between men and women, and they're shooting each other. Okay. And there's a young lady who drives to a farm. Is it a French movie? Yeah, but they're speaking English. Mm -hmm. Even though I think some of them were French actors, and so they had to overdub it in uh, like English you could understand. I love that, yeah. And so one of the first things you see once you've seen the war stuff happening, she goes to this farm, and she sees a unicorn and a dude on a horse, and she follows the dude on the horse, and then there's like a- It's a, a bad move, you follow the a unicorn. A country village, and there's a big pig, and mm -hmm. there's naked children running with the pig. And then she goes into the house, mm -hmm. and there's an old lady in bed, and she's talking to a rat. Okay. And then the rat goes away, and the girl comes in, and she gets on like a CB radio and talks you know, shit about the girl. To the Christian, radio this isn't a Discworld game? This could it be a Discworld so game. It's so weird. Huh. And kind of glorious. I'm into it. 1974. What was it? Was this streaming or was... It was streaming. It was on Hulu Plus. This is Criterion? Yeah. Man. Do you feel like Criterion is running out of films and so now they're just picking up anything weird? Well, no, I, 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 I think what they do is they'll, they'll, they'll pick stuff that everyone knows and you mm -hmm. want to have that copy of it for posterity. But then they're like, hey, by virtue of us being Criterion, we can get people to actually discover something that has been completely forgotten. <coughs> and it's not always because it's good, but maybe because it's so indicative well, of the time. Yeah, indicative of the time or influential or um, just, just strange, right? Like just yeah. strange in a way that they do something that nobody had done before. Yeah, exactly. I mean, I remember everybody had Black Orpheus on yeah. DVD, right? Yeah. Because it was Criterion, and Criterion yeah. was so new that everybody just went and bought Black Orpheus. How many times are you gonna watch Black Orpheus? I watch it a couple of times. I watch it like I think I've watched it three times in the whole time that I've See, owned I would, it. I would love them to go back and do Jean Luc Godard's mm -hmm. um, Sympathy for the Devil. Okay. Which interspersed really weird footage that's like straight out of the weekend mm -hmm. with the actual recording sessions of Sympathy for the Devil. Yeah, that was good. And it's just it's just like okay, sure. You know, we 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 we, we need to remind ourselves that once upon a time there was no one called Michael Bay. Although Michael Bay does have a Criterion film. He has more than he one. Has, yeah, he's got he has The Rock, Rock he's got Armageddon. Armageddon. And I'll tell you what, Criterion version of The Rock is real good. Comes with a lot of stuff. Yo, you cannot, it, you can front on Michael Bay all you want. The Rock is a fun movie. Did he actually direct that one? I think he produced it. Hmm? I, th I think he actually produced that. I don't know if he directed it. I don't know, let me put my pie down. Do, do you enjoy <laughs> your pie? Yeah, I know you don't like pumpkin pie. I don't like pumpkin pie. I, and it makes me think you're some sort of a spy. <laughs> I'm not a spy. Who I, am I spy for? I don't know. The I don't know. I don't know. Because, you're, because on one hand, you're kind of frail. And so you would make a, <laughs> you would make a poor spy for a, for, a, for a country that sent you in to do any kind of like wet work. But at the same time, maybe you just look frail. That's true. That, like, I actually have those kind of skills. Because every once in a while you drop a boxing reference or something and I'm just like, whoa, wait a minute. I used to box. Wait a minute. Used to. Yeah, Spy. used to. Yeah, Why don't you like pumpkin pie? What are your feelings on baseball and sitcoms? I like baseball. And sitcoms used to be funny. Norman Lear is an admirable you got, man. Okay, you got two out of three, but I'm still worried about this pumpkin pie thing. But it's just, it's not, it just doesn't make for a good pie. What's, what's, what's wrong with it? it, it what is it wrong tastes, with pumpkin pie? It tastes like mush. Like bitter mush. Look, if, if you think pumpkin pie is bitter mush, then you have just had horrible pumpkin pie after horrible pumpkin I, pie I, in your I, life. I probably have had a good one. I just didn't a know by that point. A good pumpkin pie isn't super gelatinous How like you're talking about. How about a berry? I like that because its name alone sounds like you're about to have fun. I, that was from Rayman, right? You get an alali berry and you skip ahead. No, 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 it's <laughs> actually a lala berry pie. What is a lala berry? I don't know, it's a berry that kind of sounds as fun as its name. How many, what does it taste like and when did you have this pie? I had it a while ago mm -hmm. and it tasted fun. This is just me trying to pin you down because I still think you're a spy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Josh Starks, man, Josh, Star Josh Starks. Or are, are, are oh, we there, are we, are we live or, now? Are we live? Oh, oh hello everyone. Hello. Thank you, Control. Yes, <laughs> all right, so we are here. Um, this is our special pre-Thanksgiving edition of Adam and Anthony play games in a room. Yeah, we, have, we haven't done this in a couple weeks and we were just like, because I don't know if you guys noticed, some video game things happened. Yeah, that's, 
One with a four and one with a one. It's debatable how important they were, but we haven't done this in a couple of weeks because no, we there's a lot of that stuff going on. Uh, we wanted to get one in and get, get back in the swing of things before Thanksgiving. Uh, and what better way to ring in a fun family holiday than by a marathon playthrough of Outlast? Yeah, we're just getting doing us from Outlast. where we are until the end. We're hoping that we're going to make it to the end. We have an hour. I mean, we, we, we thought we were at the end before, yeah. but we're but not. Twists and turns, my friend. Yeah, twists and turns. That's what suspense is all yeah. about. You know, and, and that's what life is all about. Mm hmm. Yeah. Yeah. You know, you think you're done with life, but then there's more. I can't, I just. Other Thanksgiving food you're fine with? Oh, I, I mean, I love turkey. I oh, love I, gravy. I do like to have my cranberries on a separate plate because I prefer my savory. Okay, this I'm, seems yeah, familiar. Yeah, we dropped our camera all the way down. Oh, that's right. And so we, we gotta, gotta go, go all the way it. back down so to the camera. So we're gonna go. Because Miles Upshur isn't afraid to crawl up rusty nails with two open wounds and missing fingers. So but he is scared this? of the dark without his camera. Is it below this floor? It's below this floor. So we've gotta go back through and we gotta find a way and down. And I assume it's gonna get dark and it's like, oh, look at the irony, you don't have your camera. Which is well, really that's ironic. What, well, that's what happened up there, and he was all like, I'm scared, and he wouldn't go any further. He turned into Gomer Pyle, and he wouldn't go any further. I mean... I'm the, I don't like... Um, I'm kind of like LL Cool J in toys, in that I don't want my food to touch, and I'll eat all yeah, of I'm, 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 I mean, I like gravy touching... Yeah, turkey. gravy is a sauce. But, 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 that's a but, different but story. Gravy touching cranberry, it's like... No. You, it, 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 you, you just undone it. You can't have it. And I like magic. to eat, and I'm one of those weird people where I will eat all of one thing on my plate before going to the next thing. I don't, I don't mix really. That's, that's very methodical for Thanksgiving. It's a little too much. I mean, how, actually, many, how, how many foods do you have on your plate? You know, if you've got like three or four things, like a vegetable and a meat, and a, well, I don't have a meat, but like if you have like a vegetable and a starch salad? or whatever, I, that's, that's not clean water. That is not clean water. Nothing in this place is clean. Do not get in that water, especially with those open wounds in your fingers. Oh yeah, that's right. Okay, here we go. All right, we're gonna drop down. You gotta drop down. But I worry that eating all of one food before moving on to the next is a little obsessive or compulsive. Um, and so I'm trying not to do that as much. All right. So it's like, what are the other you know, foods that you have at your Thanksgiving? I'm basically, because I'm a vegetarian, I'm all side dishes all the time. Oh yeah, that's right, I forgot about that. So it's stuffing and green beans and sweet potatoes. You left out, ah! oh, bad people. Give oh, me the cam I, I, Does that guy have our camera? Wouldn't uh, that be funny if... Oh, that, that, that kind of scared me. Okay. All right. Wouldn't would it be funny if I... Ah! Ah! Jerk. I was so not ready for that one. That was good. Even though I saw him run in front of me. Man, we knew it was happening. This game's got good timing. Oh, jeez, you guys. So what's, oh man, I thought we, you know. Haven't we moved beyond Zach Miner turning the is out sick today, which I thought meant that maybe someone would forget to turn the lights off. Feel better, Zach Miner. Yes. Okay. Do I want to close it or do I want to uh, go in? I think we want to go in, maybe close it behind you. Ah. Tickle My Pikachu Sorry. says, I'm wearing headphones. I'm scared with all of you. Awesome. We're in it together. Okay, so I'm in this small area. Oh, yeah. Pecan I is a level harvest design pie. gets a lot easier when you don't have the camera. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's funny that. Pecan is a harvest pie. Do you like pecan pie? I do. It can be very sweet. It can. I like the ones that are really pecan dense. See, I like a nice. Oh pop. yeah, it's that. It was glowing. It Turn is? around. Yeah. Is it battery? I think that's our camera. It, it is. Get that camera. But it doesn't want to get. That's it easy. doesn't want to get got. That's Imagine, dumb. look at that. See, the camera shows up, the level design gets complicated. <laughs> ah! You had to grab from that Sorry, side. Sorry, I just got right. I assume something scary was gonna happen. Ah! Oh, I knew that was happening! Ah! Ah! Oh, oh, it's oh, too many oh, of them! That's, that's, Run, that's a, dude! Oh, 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 Run! Running. Oh, that's right, it's on the bumper. Forgot about that. I'm not familiar with these 360 controllers Brink. anymore. There's a crack in the camera. Yeah, dude, we dropped it three stories. Well, is this gonna affect our resolution? It's gonna we affect know the our kids warranty, care about that. that's for sure. Uh-oh, interference. 
Okay, we want to get to the third floor. What floor are we on? Uh, we're on first. Okay, lights are on. I don't think the bathroom has a staircase. No, but can we jump back up the way we went <gasps> down? No. Ah! It's okay. Ah! ah! Look at that. I'm, I'm just trying to scream before this ending. Ah! <laughs> yeah! No! Yeah! Yeah! Climbing skills are the best. We did it. When you use we them. We did it. God bless America. Happy Thanksgiving. Yeah. That might be one of my better runs. Uh... Surprises says, I always eat the thing on my plate I like the least and save the best for last. Yes, ah, I do the no, same. I do that, I do that. When I was a kid, it was like, all right, I'm gonna eat these peas and then eventually I'm gonna get to this brisket. You didn't like peas either when you were a kid. No, there's, there's something about, they pop like bubbles and they're gooey inside. You know what I mean? Yeah, oh, there we go. I can't deal, I can't handle that. Um, I like them now. Yes. I, I, I think a lot of it also is that things I didn't like as a kid Sort of like with the new way that sort of America approaches the cooking with mm -hmm. the freshness. Yeah. A lot of things are a lot more palatable. That's true. And also your taste buds do change and you do like subtler tastes. It's the tastes. last thing in your body to actually evolve. Mm -hmm. You're not supposed to be at the height of your taste buds until you're in your 20s. So I've even peaked in terms of taste buds? Oh, I'm, I've, I've been in decline <laughs> just for a long time. Man, really everything just falls off. Yeah, really everything. Uh, ah, Rusty Shackleford. What's your favorite food on Thanksgiving? Turkey doesn't count because F U be creative. That's fair. Ah, you whoops, gotta put the forgot. camera down and do the jumpy. Oh, is that right? That's yeah. right. You know, kids, that, that's that's a good tip for life. Put the camera down. You know, that is a good tip for life. Live your life. Observe your life. You know, be in it. Don't be documenting it all the time. Everyone that's what treats, happened to Miles. Everyone tre treats life like prom. It's like you go to the prom to get the photo to shoot, show you were at prom, but you didn't do anything else. You go to prom so you can sneak out afterwards and get drunk. Wait, hold on. What's, what's the jump button in this game? Uh, it's not the one you're pushing. <laughs> <laughs> I, it's been two weeks. I know, just push them all. Which one's jump? I think, is it A? There you go. Yeah. Oh, that's kind of a mild-mannered jump. I well, guess Miles he's a, he, is kind of mild man. He's, yeah, he's just a regular dude. <clears throat> With a camera. There we go. Uh, Seidel. I'm my favorite. My favorite Thanksgiving food is probably uh, the sweet potatoes with the marshmallows on top. Oh, you actually do it with the marshmallows. Gotta do marshmallows. See, I, see, why I, I don't like sweet things, period, which is probably one of my reasons I'm not a pumpkin pie guy. Are you a stuffing guy? I'm a stuffing guy. Yeah, stuffing's kind of the jam. He knows. Wait, is Miles uh, going to make that jump? I don't know that he can. Why is Miles here? Well, Should Miles that's... have gone through that door? Oh, is there a way to sidle on that other side? Because that's where we were trying to go, for sure, uh, at your 3 o'clock, or at your 9 o'clock. Yeah, you're absolutely right. Um, Irish that... Nightmare says that he puts gravy on his honey ham, and that's wrong. You're wrong to do that. There, I said it. Hey, can we have ham without the honey? I mean, you could, but why? Well, why well, would you do it without a honey? Well, because you don't like sweet. But a yeah. honey glaze, dude, honey glaze is where it's at with ham. No, there's nothing to side on. Yeah, that there. was. Is there a window to go out or something? Uh. No, I mean, it's, it, it, it's like it wants us to go there. Yeah, we definitely have to go that way. Uh, Nabiza says, even if Miles survives and gets out, he's gonna die from the massive infection in his wounds. Yeah. Oh, this man is a walking tetanus awareness Well, act. not only that, but he's, he's- Oh, do you think I jump over there? No, there's still no. I think, hmm. Do a run and jump and see how, see how oh. Yeah, do a run and jump and see how far we get. <laughs> oh, just man, barely missed. Man, Miles. Just barely missed. Is there another way out of this room? Oh, uh, they're all ganging up against me. Gravy is good on almost everything. Yeah, that's fine, guys. Oh, no, gravy is very good on But on a ham? Well, okay, if it's a bad ham, it's probably a good idea. Well, good food. You put gravy on any bad food, and yeah, it's better because gravy yeah. rules. That's, nobody's arguing that gravy but rules. But see, you, you know what the whole problem is with turkey gravy? Can we do a, no, because that, that column is there. What's the problem with turkey gravy? Turkeys don't have much fat, and without no. fat, you don't really get much gravy. Uh, 
can we? Is this a sidling option? No, there's no sidling there. There's no sidling. Huh. Well, this is a conundrum. Does the internet have ideas? Is there any, is there any other way out of this room that we haven't tried, like down on the lower level? Well, we want to go to the third floor. We're on the third floor. I think we should get sure. a way in. Well. And like you had such an easy little like jump up yeah, and Yeah, but do that's stuff. because that's where this happened to us before. That's where we got that little. Oh yeah, well, how did we get in the room the last time? We, we jumped that jump that we, that we just missed, but what happened was he kind of scrabbled and it didn't hold his weight. Uh, Remember, and it fell. All right, and so we this dropped might the not be. Okay, yeah. may, maybe, maybe we need new. You can kind of cheat and jump at it diagonally at the end. It inches a little past the column. It, uh, I don't know if it looks that way. It, yeah, maybe, but maybe I, I think does. we're not doing what the game is designed to have us do. I mean, can we go up to that other to that? Can you can we make? No. Oh, well, Maybe, hmm. here? On the bed frame, yeah. No? To the side, to the other side maybe? Like bed frame up to those planks? Oh, you might have something there. No. No. It's amazing his physical acuity in some instances <laughs> and not yeah. in others. Yeah, uh, I, think, I think they're right. I think maybe we can do a diagonal. Yeah, Let's give it a I, shot. I don't see any other options. Evil Jim says, jump up from the ground, you fools. Well, we just did that. And there's no need What does good get, Jim say? There's no need to get mean. Yeah, put good Jim on the line. Yeah. Can we talk to good Jim now? Yeah. Is good Jim in there? <laughs> when I count to three and snap my fingers, I'm going to be speaking to good Jim. Yeah, maybe like a, maybe like a diagonal jump to that longer bit. Do a run jump. Yeah! Oh! oh, Evil Jim! Well, Evil Jim didn't say that. Let's not oh. give him credit for that. No, Evil Jim. Evil Jim was just being, uh, that was Cyrus 99004. Thank you, Cyrus. Yeah. You're so much better than your younger brother, Jim. <laughs> if gravy makes everything better, give Adam pumpkin pie with gravy on it. Challenge accepted? No! <laughs> it makes everything better, not every pumpkin pie better. Pumpkin pie is a thing. It's a major in, thing. In your world of pretend. In the American world, for it's Oh, ah, okay. It's the falling apart asylum. Is there a sidling option over there? Looks that way. Oh. Oh, you've gotta be. Oh, to the. Oh, hold on, but I think maybe that was the right thing to do. Hey, man. Is he a friendly? Are you one of those dudes that's just gonna freak out? Only one way out, only one way. Oh, okay. Well, let's go. We're just gonna leave Close that there. door, yeah. yeah. Thank you How's for you your friendly place? advice. Pork chops breaded with Ritz crackers and butter dip. That sounds pretty good. What, what the hell is a butter dip? I think it's just, you know, when they like, they give you a ramekin of melted butter with like some, some spices in it, like they give you at a restaurant. Like at a steakhouse? You've never had them do that? I've never had the butter dip. Especially with the word dip, I mean. Or maybe butter. he just literally dips and, it into don't butter. Don't get me wrong, I, I like the butter. Sure. Yeah, uh, Miles, why are you slamming doors? Well, this is a, a well-kept room. Yeah, why is this room doing so well? What happens in this room? So we're supposed to find Father Friendly yeah. in the administration office. Okay. She any clues or batteries? <laughs> uh, no. But there are a lot of rooms up here along this hallway, so. Uh, recreation hall. Oh, no, it's not the guy. Dude, dude don't. Dude, keep your cool. Keep your cool. Ah! He, oh. oh, he who. Run. Wait, 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 what's over there? Ah, no! Oh, he's doing that entrails thing. Oh, nice teeth. <clears throat> you wanna take a whirl? Sure, I'll give you this thing. Man, I felt so confident, and then I felt not confident. Sure. Well, it's hard it's... to keep that, that sense of self-esteem when oh. your entrails are being pulled out by a giant man. 
Well, but you might think, hey, this was the right way to go. So, okay, so there's Angry yep. Fellow. Angry Fellow's over there. Ah, now I am going to agree with Chaos Machina. Deviled eggs are the single best Thanksgiving food oh, hands down. Deviled eggs, I man. don't know why you need to caveat it with Thanksgiving. I, I can, think they might be among the best food. I could eat a dozen deviled eggs yeah. anytime, anywhere, any place. You know, I once got out of a mugging because of deviled eggs. Do tell. Um, I was in the Lower Hayden, this was over a decade ago, and it wasn't like, I don't think the guy had a weapon, but he was kind of gesture like he did. Yeah. And he said, give me $20. And I kept on saying, like, yeah, I would, but I have to go to my friend's house because she's making deviled eggs and they're really good. And I just tried to pretend like the guy was um, panhandling. And I frustrated him enough that he gave up. That's so And funny. I kept on saying, like, no, but I, mean, I was like, yeah, I'd love to help you, man, but I really need these deviled eggs. To be fair, my friend's deviled eggs weren't that good. I think that's really funny, just feigning that you are too, you're just too obtuse to understand that you're being robbed. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> It's, I think it's the only trick I found to get by in life is get, get dumb. It doesn't work in Outlast, which is unfortunate. Hey, that guy, what are you doing in here with me? Oh, you're dead. Oh. Okay, nothing to worry about. Just a dead guy. Do you think he was like doing some yoga? And Do you it's think like, it's, in I this situation, living in this situation, uh -huh. Miles Upshur would be as desensitized to dead bodies at this point as we are? Or I do think you so. think he would just be like, it, it would be too much shock. The shock would have gotten him now and he would be cowered in a corner. I think. Ooh, how do they want me to interact? Like, I what is, know. I don't know. Hey, everybody. Oh. Uh, hey, we've been here before. Library. This is the part that we saw earlier. Yeah, we're back down in the main so everything. So maybe we are getting close to an end of this game. I don't like the strings. Strings? Yes. Yeah, scary string music. It means somebody's in the air. Oh, strings. Like uh, the string section. Yeah. And I'm not saying I don't think that they're good musicians. Do you think these are, this is an excellent score. And Philharmonics, like they have like intramural softball between the like the brass and the strings. And oh, the I think they're totally rivals. I think there are rivalries. I think there are cliques. Do you think they make fun of the guy on the timpanis? Oh, for sure. Yeah. I think percu I think anybody that's on small percussion just gets laughed at. Hey, Father Friendly must be nearby. That's where I left the car. Oh no. Okay. Retrieve the key from the recreation hall. That's kind of cute they have a recreation hall. Coming. Who's walking? I think that was the guy who was like, hey, look, I don't have skin on my face. Recreation I'm hall. I'm skinless face man. Up. Is that up? Really? Yeah. I think it's more of a forward. Okay. This door needs a key. You don't think like Coach is the one with the key to the recreation hall? <laughs> There's just a coach. Yeah, just, just a, a, soft, just a soft cap. <laughs> sitting in an Econoline van. Huh. Well, maybe it's through that door upstairs. The one that was open. So it's like the sign doesn't say recreation hall key place. Well, I mean, it is saying recreation hall forward. Of which. But we can't go this, forward. This would be back. This is where we came from. Should Those are our own bloody footprints, because we're bleeding real bad. Like, we're <coughs> bleeding out pretty hard. Just, you know, FYI. I know. There's not a lot of blood left in Miles Upshur's body. It's too bad we're not getting, like, the inner monologue of Miles. I don't think so. Like, because <laughs> I would love to get a better sense of, like, I need the story. Yeah, because this all seems, here we go. Cause this all seems like bad decision dinosaur. You know what I'm saying? Like, I wanna know what's keeping Miles from getting in the van. Hey, buddy. I just need to get into the recreation hall if that's cool.
You kind of need to feel like you can meet the guy who designed this place. Yeah. This is like the Winchester Mystery House of Asylums. Or the Winchester Mystery Asylum. Is there really a Winchester Mystery Asylum? Well, I would go visit it. No, but I mean, they did so well with the house, why didn't they expand? <laughs> like how Animal Crossing was a town and then it became city folk. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. They're like, hey, why, why do you why not just have, Why just have one crazy woman in a house? Yeah. Why not have a building full of all the crazy people? You know, it's like the Chelsea Hotel of Animal Crossing. <laughs> Man, that's a great idea. They're not gonna do that, are they? No. Yeah. Although I would love to see like, I would love to discover K.K. Slider in his room, <laughs> dead of an overdose. <laughs> like I feel like that would really add to the Animal Crossing like, <laughs> mythology. He just couldn't handle the fame, man. We oh oh. Yeah, what if they had like an expansion for Animal Crossing <laughs> called Disenchanted Creatives? <laughs> you have like a Bukowski bird. I'd be into it, man. I want to see like- That could be like one of the greatest games ever. I want to, yeah. And all they're doing is writing letters to one another, because that's what they did. Animal Crossing as hometown that you come Whoa. back to. Uh, exit interview recorded December 27th, 1985 in Los Alamos, New Mexico. Clearance Sierra Alpha, subject Dr. Rudolph Wernicke, 14866. Oh, it's our friend, it's the, the evil Kelsey Graham. Uh, there was no alteration to the footage at all, no triggering. Uh, in June of 1943, you recorded three instances of spontaneous bleeding. Uh, half a dozen test subjects began to develop brain tumors. Yes. The autopsies revealed that the tumors were pure dead. It killed them? Can you explain why the results could not be reproduced in the United States? I have my theories. My homeland in those years. Can you explain it's why your faith is a constantly changing war shack test? Hurt. No? All right. Because it's learning? So do you think the interference is like the camera's busted or there's evil? Oh, camera's busted. Uh, there is also evil, but... Yeah, but is the evil messing with the cameras? The evil just, you know, pretty much just being evil. I think it's just, I think the evil is just being evil. I don't know. Okay. Hey, man. You look like a key guy. If I was a recreation room team, what would I be doing? Oh, I'm just gonna look at some of these. Uh... This is going to be awesome on the PS4, particularly since it'll be free with PS Plus. Oh, this is uh, PS, uh, I didn't realize that. Yeah, the first time I, I played a little bit of this was at the PlayStation booth at E3. Oh, they had this going. Please put down the camera. But we need it to see. Yeah. See, it's all dark. I know there are cracks in the camera, but that's the game. Wait, is there evil out there? Nah. Oh, not yet. You know it's coming. Do you have mushrooms for Thanksgiving? Like a mushroom dish? I don't. A fungus? I don't think we have like a straight up mushroom only thing, no. Should though. Mushrooms I love, make I a nice love gravy. mushrooms. They mushrooms do. Mushrooms are great. Mushroom gravy, I mean, that's it's really the only gravy I eat. So I'm way into mushroom gravy. No, mushrooms, mu mushrooms just, yeah, I, I think they need a little more attention when it's not like they drugs. Don't, yeah, they don't get their props, really. I want mushrooms to get more credit than they do. Do we have any clue what we're doing here right now? Yeah, man, we're looking for a key. I know. Are we like on the path of the key? Sure. I think we have to go under the table because there's blood. That's what they call it. That's, that's an underbrain. The thing. Maybe that's the thing about Miles. He just loves blood. He's just, he is a big blood aficionado, this he guy. He just, he's like, look, more blood, I'm gonna follow it. I'm Miles, blood lover. It's his screen name. Hey, can you suggest educational games that don't suck other than the God, oh. you jerk! This is an educational game. Yeah, we're learning a lot of life skills. You know what I learned? Don't go here. What, now you don't want to open it, Miles? What's up, Miles? 
You know the key's in there. Let's do you, this. You really want to open it? Of course I want to open it. Oh, do you think the other guy locked it? He might have locked it, but Miles didn't even grab for it. Well, there's a hiding place. Yeah. Maybe we climb something? Real low ceilings in here. Let me go this way. Did we come that way? Ah! I think that guy took our key. But he came that way, which means he must know of a way. Maybe well, he opened this door, I think, because this was locked. So he now, opened the door to our hearts. My love opened the door. My love opened the door. Do you like the uh, Do you like the Radio Rocky remix of that, or do you like the uh, keyboard Radio he Rocky? The keyboard the keyboard heavy mix of that. I like the keyboard one. I like the keyboard one. But who's one this too. Radio Rocky guy? Oh no no no! It's just the Radio one was like the Rocky oh, remix. Oh, got it, got it. Break! Whoa, you did it! Well done. That I wasn't really a break. The jump you know. that, was, that was kind of a jump. That was kind of a jump. Yeah, that wasn't really a we break. Needed to, we need to differentiate at some point what the difference is between a jump and a break. Well, a jump is kind of sliding over the... Oh, look at that. Guess who's so. going to a rec room? Woo! Yeah, we're going to play some dodgeball. Who's we may be part cheesy because we're party. not able to move easily and our hands are bleeding. I have a funny feeling something bad's going to happen shortly. Yep. Because that fun fellow went this way. Yep. Things are about to get real bad for us. You know, maybe we're just lost in one complex game of hide and go seek. Oh, you guys. All right. Yeah, you can feel the fun coming. You can feel the fun. Oof. What happens when the battery dies on the camera? We put another battery in it. Oh, it's oh, big guy, man. it's big guy. Where's he at? Stupid suck face. Uh, I think I saw, I, I think I saw a little bit of his flap. Yeah, or maybe that's someone oh, else. Oh boy. I don't want to be near whoever it is. He doesn't look that big. Nope. Apologies to everyone for my coughing. I am fighting off the remnants of the cold. Or the black lung. Or black lung. We don't know yet. Yeah. Fingers crossed it's a cold. Well, you know, me and me and my mining, you know, if I'm not playing games, I'm miming. It soothes the nerves. Yes. <laughs> you know what? After these console launches, it would. Get out of here. That's not an outdoor. What was the indoor? I think we dropped down from somewhere. We did? No. Here we go. Exit. Are we sure that, like, dude who was wandering was... Is that a fun door? Yeah, that's not a fun door. <sighs> that door is filled with promise. All right, here we go. Up All right. the stairs. Follow the blood. All right. Let's go to the rec room. Woo! Yeah, some volleyball. Maybe some badminton. I think we were just in the rec room. We were? Murkoff Corporation. This is where things get sinister. Oh, I bet they're doing some experiments. We saw the, uh, we saw the soldiers coming in the beginning. Soldiers. And we are the security force, the Murkoff security force. We saw them on the security cameras in the very beginning. Oh, I forgot about that. But they haven't done that. anything nice, with nice them. Nice memory. So I'm waiting to see what happens when Father Martin? Coke machine? That's just cola. Maybe he'll offer us one. That? Captain Kangaroo? Oh no, it's just a dude. Oh, just another one of these weird leather faces. Sorry, leather face. Oh, up on that Coke machine. Yeah, the Sorry. bright light. Cola <gasps> machine. Yeah, it's just cola. You ever been offered an RC cola? I like RC cola. <sighs> See, now I think <gasps> you're a spy. You know, I think it's just, uh, 
grow, growing up in the South, there was a lot of RC Cola around, and it's real sugary sweet, and I think that's to awesome me, when you're a kid. It's more accurate. Then again, I don't like cola. You also don't like pumpkin pie. Well, yeah. Look, there are leeches. If you're out there and you don't like pumpkin pie like I don't like pumpkin pie, let yourself be known. So I'm not suffering under the indignities. Hold on, we were here. Yeah, I didn't like where we ended up. We ended up right back where we were. I'm gonna try some other things. This isn't an other things kind of game, is it? Ah. Also, nobody's crazy enough to hate pumpkin pie with you. Crazy. No, someone here is gonna understand my feelings on pie. Not a fan of pumpkin pie. What, who? <coughs> Excuse me, guys, sorry. Who is that? James V. 1971. Have him banned. Burgle. I don't like pumpkin pie either. Not Matt Foreman. I can do without pumpkin pie. Who are you people? Tripping Possum. I hate pumpkin pie. Whoa. Yes, we are legion. Whoa. Other people that don't like pumpkin pie, it's a squash, and squash should be served with butter and not with sugar. Where are we supposed to go? Everyone loves pumpkin pie, Adam, you're wrong. See, thank you. Yeah, but me and four other people, we're right. I think the only four people in the world that hate pumpkin pie. No, I bet there's some other guy too. It's like one other dude? Yeah, but he's our leader. He's the one that sends us out to report on the others. <laughs> you are a spy. No, I'm not a spy, I'm, I'm more like a speed. A speed? A speed, <laughs> you know, spies are people who actually do something useful. We're, just, we're just kind of a, we're, we're, we're just kind of a club of interlopers. Just a spy. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know, that event doesn't seem to take me anywhere interesting. It's strange that they would include it. Is it? I've seen a lot of up things. A lot of up? Are there any other up places? Is there an up shot? There's an up sure. Yeah, Miles. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Miles. Word play instead of uh, finding a door. There we change go. Batteries. Uh, Nothing like changing a battery. I, I like, can I tell you how funny it is that we keep finding AA batteries, but if you look at the model for the camera, uh -huh. there is a camcorder battery on the back of it. Oh, I thought it was a nine volt. Like, it's clearly, next time we trade, change batteries, I'll show you. But it's got like the little arrow on it and everything. Yeah. All right, nothing creepy there. Yeah, things have been a little bit too mellow too much lately, so I wonder what, Hey, is that, is that a rec room? Pool. That's a recreation. Pool is a recreation. Are you good at pool? I've never been able to get good at pool. You know what? This is how pool works for me. I have two beers, I have three really good shots, and then I fall apart. Yeah. I mean, that's how pool always plays out. I'll land one thing. I'm the same with pool as I am with bowling. I'll land one or two things that make you think early on in the game that I'm really good, and then I just totally lose it. I can't hold on to it. it I don't know yeah, how I did it. It really is a focus. I am not fast Eddie. I'll say that. You're the color of money. I never saw it. It's a good movie. Really? Is it really a good movie? Yeah, really. Is it a good movie? I haven't seen it in a long time, but I remember it being a good movie. It's kind of, it's like that sequel to, uh... The Hustler. The Hustler, yeah. No, I love The Hustler. It's a brilliant movie. It's got, it's got uh, young Tommy Cruise. Oh, um, that, that's the selling point? Uh, I think at the time. Are they dead or are they actually still genuflected? Hard to say. This one's got his jeans laid out for tomorrow morning. Hmm. For school. Yeah. I think that's optimistic. I think it's optimistic to plan for the morning in this place. Yeah, <laughs> it's, it's optimistic to think there's morning. I mean, we've been at this for a while. Sun oh should man, be up who now. are all these guys prank, man? This is about to get super creepy. I bet they're praying to Azatov. <sighs> Things are gonna get mad creep. So one guy here is describing Turkey as a reptilian bird. Would you describe it that way? Uh, it certainly looks that way and they have that sort of texture. I get where he's coming from. Ooh, batteries. We're gonna have an alkaline party by the end of this game. All right. 
that the way we came in? No. And, you know, these... Wait, is it? Because there was a bathroom. I know we passed a bathroom. Man. Well, that's not an exit. Uh, not yet, anyway. How about the uh, door across from you? This guy? Yeah. That was where we found Oh, uh, that's where we came in. No, we came oh, through that way. Yeah. Okay. So our goal is to get back into that hallway. Yeah. So we can't do it that way. Wait, why are we trying to get back in the hallway? I can't remember what we're doing. We're in the rec room. We're like, no, no, no. We were in the rec room. They were showing a movie. Right. Now we are trying to meet Father Martin. Will he have pie? Do we yeah, go down that hallway? It's going to be pumpkin, though. I think we need to go down that hallway. We haven't gone down the creepy hallway. Oh, we went down the creepy hallway, but I thought it was a dead end. There may have been something I, I, I think we're missing something. Nope. We have to be. I don't think so. But this is the place that we hadn't been to. It's not giving me the prompt. Well, we've, we've been there, but I, I thought it was a dead end. It's not giving us, man. Miles, what's going on here? What's your life? It would be funny if this wasn't Miles, but it was Milos Forman, director of Amadeus. <laughs> and Man on the Moon. <laughs> yeah, and, and the People versus Larry Flint. Man, Milos Forman's a good director. Yeah, he likes to do the important movies. They're like, yeah, I got one of them scripts about a guy who did some stuff that was kind of controversial, but in the end, people really admired him. They're like, get Milos. He comes in, he makes it. Hey, here we go. Oh, look at that. We are outdoors again. Oh, man. And here we're we getting sidled. You're sidled by going forward. Yep. Yeah. Here we go. Who knows what excitement awaits us? Could it be the end of the game? Could it be that Father Martin's like, hey! Oh boy, here or we go. Could it be a letter in blood? God hates, hates sickness. sickness. Okay. Yeah. Things are about God, God hates, hates money. Oh boy. Oh boy. God always provides a way. Oh, this is super cr oh. Oh, oh, that was an eye full of phallus. Oh, man. And it was ill phallus. Is that a Roomba? This is it. I thought it was a Roomba. This is it. My Job, you alone shall escape the Talva. This is your penultimate act of witness. The promise of the prophets was always freedom from death. <laughs> And here it is. You will watch and record my death, my resurrection. And together we will be free. What if I just left them? You are no longer in any danger. I fixed the elevator. It will take you to freedom. We will all of us be free. Okay. Is it the elevator to freedom no, or is it like Willy Wonka? Okay. Okay, I'm out. I'm out. That's it. Bye, That's Father it. Martin. I can't leave. Okay, there we go. I didn't want us to go that way. Do you think they rehearsed that? <gasps> Stepping away like that in unison? Well, just they, like the whole thing. <gasps> like, do you think they had like a dry run? Probably. A dress rehearsal? It would be super embarrassing to try to martyr yourself by I know, fire and I know. have it I'm fail. It's like dramatic. It's like, it's like you know, all of a sudden, like, the floor. Lint's not working. And sorry, you can't, you can't. sorry guys, just one yeah. minute. One minute until my death and resurrection. So sorry. Oh no, it's him! Oh boy. Wow. Yeah? How do we get out of here? I think we were here before. Ah! Oh, let's go that way, yeah, let's go that way. Ah! Ah! The elevator, the elevator. Whoa! I, I, I'm going to the place no. where there's a hallway. There's a hallway. No. Yeah, that hallway. There's a hallway. Action time! I bet there might be some drinking, so get your finger ready on the A button. Gee. I would have gone that way because it's an open Gee. door. It's an open uh, door. Oh. I freaked out. I freaked out, man. I freaked out and I lost it. I freaked out. I freaked out and I lost it. Oh. 
So is this, we have the elevator key? I think we're in the elevator key, and Spankles McFun Fun is after us. We're gonna go into the door of happiness. We're gonna go around. We're gonna go to the door of... He's gonna try to break in here. Yeah, he's a little... Okay, let's go that way. Run, 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 run. We passed you. You weren't ready for that there. Yeah, I would go, yeah. Towards the light. There we go. There, 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 she ended up, uh, uh, cola, ah, look at that. The cola, the cola, cola vent. RC Cola saves us. Did we want to do that? Yes. Yes, we did. Man, you don't know where we are. You don't even know who we it's are. the elevator. You don't know where we've been. It's the elevator to You don't feel. know my life. Get out of my face. Yeah, we're in the elevator. Ooh. Double down. Yes, it might be a metaphor for going to hell, but who cares? Yo. It might be better. We are not getting out of here. You know that. Well, there might be. Oh, a twist. Was that the, was that the exit? That was the exit. Because, because didn't like Dr. Snaggletooth? We are not getting out of here. Are there new layers? Are there new areas? Is I this think. Secret? I would, please don't go pick it back to the sewer. Find another no way, way out. out. Thank you, Outlast. What? Whoa. Uh, meanwhile, in the first act of Batman and Robin. Uh. What? This got a little weird. Yeah, this, this just got crazy weird. What is this logo? What is this thing? Whoa. Whoa. The Wall Rider Project. Hey, this is, this is kind of like, uh, you know, the Resident Evil movie. Yeah. With the thing underneath the stuff. Yeah. It was a high tech thing all along. It okay. Was a front. For the spies, for the pumpkin pie spies. The spies. The spies. Sorry, the pumpkin pie spies. This, the, all this carnage is a little more than a spie. This is like a spy. This is this is kind of a botched maneuver. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I would say. Why the ice? Uh, the keeping it chill. What if what if the only way out of the of the asylum is through John Carpenter's The Thing? That'd be like, really interesting. <laughs> They're like, McCready, what are you doing here? No! It's like a reverse new heart ending. Like you wake yeah. up and everything is <laughs> everything is terrible. What? This really is an interesting turn of events. Yeah. Hey, here are some documents. According to these documents, that thing in there is a head. Yup. Where do you want to put the head? I don't, just throw it in there from all the high Just make sure you log it in the documents. <laughs> uh, Variant postmortem? Uh, oh, that's a lot of words. Wall rider patients showing no more signs of accepting the therapy than all the others. There have been a slight gains in cell migrate. Yeah, we know they're making a creepy guy. Yeah. We get Harvey it. Harvey Wallrider. Yeah, you know, for, for those out there that would go by the strange title of mixologist, if you want to design yeah. a drink called a Harvey Wallrider. If, if Drunken we, Moogle's out there, yeah. if you're watching Drunken Moogle, we want a Harvey Wallrider. Yeah, the Wallrider's gonna kill us, so Adam. You know when, that, when, right? when you talk about Los Alamos, is that like where we are? Do you think we're in New Mexico? No. Okay. Do you think we're in Idaho? Private Idaho? Maybe we're just like outside Milwaukee. Whoa, 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 whoa! Ah, the wall rider! Wall rider! Harvey wall rider's coming! Uh, that way. Okay, we're gonna break. Break. Oh no, it's locked now! Is that a door? I think it was the door back there. It was locked! Why? You should know there's a door on the other side. What? It was an interesting looking room. You're an interesting looking Perhaps room. Perhaps there was a collectible. You're a collectible. Get me out of here! Uh, ah! Whoa! No more The Wall Riders getting them! Whoa! Wall Riders are free! Whoa! Wall Riders are luchador! Yes! Harvey! Whoa! 
not so real. Wall Rider is completely different. The wall Rider is like Ghost Rider. Maybe they know each other. Maybe the Wall Rider is Patrick Swayze from Ghost. That's why he's helping us. It would be awesome. Miles made a friend. Is that a person? No, no such luck. I am older than sin, but somehow the only one left because of Billy. Billy Wall. He takes care of me. He may think I'm his father. He certainly loves me, the poor idiot. Do you know what this symbol represents? No. It warns of a nano hazard. Microscopic machines, technology we have had for decades but never mastered. Murkoff discovered in my research a workaround. Oh. Turning the cells in the human body into nano factories. Gotcha. It's the natural function of cells to produce molecules, but through psychosomatic direction, um, we engineer the precise molecules really necessary. Yeah. Probably Mind that over body. <laughs> FedEx to secret sub lab. I know, that's the thing. <laughs> is, like, is it on Google now? Yeah. To okay. use Madman to make something so strong. So Billy is you the giant have monster to stop guy. Him to murder Billy. Okay. Turn off his life support. Okay. His anesthesia. You have to undo what I've done. No one can get out of this place while he lives. You must kill him. But you cut off my switching fingers. We gotta find <laughs> Billy. Morphogenic engine. All right, that just. So do we shut. actually understand things now? Yeah. So the asylum is a front for this creepy lab where they were using nanotechnology to experiment the on people. The asylum is a very elaborate front. Sure. But did you see that painting? He has very elaborate tastes. Yeah. Sci-fi lab sound. Whoa, Billy, whoa. Billy, Billy! Whoa, Wall Rider, Wall Rider. No, no, no. We're fine. We're cool. No, you and I but are I cool. Thought, I, I thought we were friends. We're cool. No! We're not cool! Yeah. Is he in us? Yeah, he got all up in us. Oh, Here. I thought we had powers. Yeah, I thought you thought maybe the Wall Rider was going to join us. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Ashen says, I wasn't really expecting this to turn into a Metal Gear Solid game. I don't think any of us were. No. How we're does nanotechnology make Let's... ghosts? Oh, you simple fool. I don't know. That makes it makes no sense to me either. It okay. just makes them ghost-like, I guess. No, it's not really a ghost. Billy, don't upset Billy. We have got to find the main lab and destroy Billy. Is it that way? Now, that's the wall rider. If you go towards... Or is that the wall rider? One of these ways goes, goes straight towards the wall rider. Because the whole follow the blood rule doesn't work. There's just that much of it. When in <laughs> the bearded wonder. When in doubt, nano machines. You got it, buddy. You need to explain something away. Is this an action exit? Okay. No. Ah! Wall rider! What do we do? Stay clear of them. Well, thanks. That's what I would do. This is when you stay clear. Ah, wall rider! Wall rider! Get in there! Get in there! Run, wall rider! Wall rider's evil! Out of the way! Stay away, wall rider! Let's be friends, wall rider! We'll ride a wall together. Des Fezable says wall rider is supposed to be the physical embodiment of one's negative psychological states. I think probably, but nano machines. So I think we were on the we were on the right track there. That was the right way. Yeah. All we gotta do is flip off Billy's nano machines. Man, what would we do without the word nano? What if? Wall rider, stop! Let me open up the door, wall rider. Do you? I'm assuming closing the door behind us isn't gonna help. Probably not. Yeah. 
Harvey it's not Wall that high Rider up. is non corporeal. All right, upstairs in the lab of evil. Going this way. All right, it's all right. The way to go. Danger music's gone. Whoa. That door is closed. Oh no. This got really black Mesa. All right. <laughs> Bad <Right>. day. <laughs> I'll tell you. What if Miles Upshur is like cub reporter? What if he's a stringer? What if this is like his first big assignment? I, I, I bet it is. <gasps> what? Whoa. Hive mine, hive mine, tesseract. Everything has just gotten too dumb. What? <laughs> Turn off the valve. Do it, man. Well, there are people in them eggs. But what's the valve? What does the valve look like? Uh. Is that a valve? There's a valve somewhere. Oh, that one's just filled with blood. Cool. Cool valve. Is that a valve? There's a valve somewhere. This is where you put valves? I think that was the actual life support. Now we're looking for the valve that controls it. Do they have signs? Life support fluid reservoir? Is that a valve? Yeah, sure. Yeah, life support. Yes. Good. That's the valve. That's the valve. Where? There. Oh, it's up there. It's up there. Let's get to the valve. Uh, Wall Rider is a spooky ghost that lives inside of Billy. So he's not the strong guy, I guess, is what everybody's saying. Billy is, is a little boy on life support. He's projecting the Wall Rider into the world. Okay. Cool story. Why can't he project like, you know, someone else? Oh, 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 oh. Do, Do not, not turn, turn the valve! Take that! Cut, Cut off, off the there. electric supply from the sub-lab generator. Okay, the lack of evil is kind of confusing right here. Yeah, you would, where's the sub-lab? I assume it's the other direction, as okay. everything else is when you do things in this game? Sure. Okay, back to um, the everybody's, chamber. Everybody would like to remind us uh, about the video game Fear and the ending of Fear. Yes, you are all right. Good on you guys. Is that the end of the world? That one, is that the end of the world? No, fear is, fear is like the lab and the psychic projections and stuff, right? For sub lab. I mean, I remember that game. That game was like a warehouse palooza. All right, where's the evil? Miles. Yeah, that'd be kind of funny. Like, it's like, hey, go do the story on this stuff. And yeah. like, by the end, it's like, I'm saving the world. I'm, I'm Miles. Miles to go before I sleep. <laughs> uh -huh. Robert Frost humor, kids. That's a little, that's a little mnemonic to wall rider, wall rider. Well, where? Here. Oh, yeah, you're right, when he gets all hazy. Uh, come on, wall rider, get off my butt. Billy does not want you turning off his life support. Really, that's so selfish. Billy, it's for the good of everyone. It's like, well, my mom would turn off my NES. Jump! Ah! We did it! Wall rider riding on walls. Oh, I really, I think I botched no. that one. Go run! Go. Oh, no, you man, that was so good. the right way. You did come good. Come on, Billy, come on, Billy, come on, Billy. Billy. Somebody just said that we're the Abbott and Costello of survival horror. That's pretty true. All right. We got so close. I thought this we was going to be it. I thought this was going to be it. We're going to leave it off because uh, Anthony and I have to go prepare ourselves, steal ourselves for, well, Thanksgiving. Yeah, I guess. I, I mean, guess this just was for a nice primer for, for, for the experience. That so, is this is a lot like going home for Thanksgiving, actually, this game. No, no, it is. Yeah. Uh, it, when. So, uh, yeah, so we did not finish this, but that's fine. We'll finish it, we'll I finish it like next we're week. Close. We're close to something. Yeah. We'll be doing this again next week, regular time, Thursday. Maybe the, game, maybe the game twists and turns again, and it's, it's Dino Crisis at the end. Who can, be, who can say? I'm a Dino Crisis, too, because that was Dinosaurs in Space. There you go. Uh, so, yeah, so we will be back next week tomorrow. Tomorrow. At 3 o'clock 
Tara Long and I are going to hang out. It's going to be a big Anthony and Tara Palooza, really, because there's a new episode of Hard Science on YouTube.com slash Hard Science Show. That is the experiment show that we host together. If you have not seen that show, that show is one of the best things on the internet. Oh, Hands my down. stars. That is my honest opinion. Shut didn't your pay mouth. Me. Come on. <laughs> and... Um, at 3, 3 p.m. Pacific time, we're going to play uh, Super Mario Cats and Friends. Ooh, the I like Super that Mario one. 3D World, which I am stoked to sit down and spend a chunk of time with. Uh, thank you guys. Be sure to subscribe and follow us. And we're also on the tweets. I'm A Carboni. I'm um, A. Oh, at Adam Sessler. That's and right. That's uh, my name. we'll see you next week. All right. Happy Thursday, ha Thanksgiving. Yeah, or Thursday if you're not from the 50. United yeah. States. But if you're not from the U.S., you're not supposed to be watching this. Show. Yeah.